So we've got yeah. three wines here. We've got uh, this one we're going to try right now. It's the Monterey uh, Pinot Noir. This is from Arroyo Seco ABA. Um, all three of these we, we brought in uh, about mid-September. Um, came in and, and uh, sorted the fruit, um, threw it in tank and cold soaked for a couple days. Um, fermentations lasted about two weeks or so. Um, this was all native fermented, so this is all this kind of natural spontaneous fermentation. Um, uh, this Monterey Pinot has kind of some components of these other guys, but um, this Pomard clone we did 150 cases of. Um, that Pomard clone I, I picked a little bit earlier, um, ended up having a lot more natural acidity than the other ones. Um, and then that 777 was a, a property that I, I, I had four clones to choose from, so I brought all four in separately into some fermentation bins. Um, I just love the way this 777 kind of opened up and developed. So. Uh, we decided to bottle yeah, that on our own. So, um, yeah, uh, secondary fermentation happened again spontaneously. We just let these pinots go through as natural as possible. Um, <clears throat> there's no new French oak on this. This is all uh, 2012 French oak uh, neutral. So, um, and then we bottled this today. So, you know, it's had maybe eight months of, of aging, eight nine months, and um, we're gonna let this hang out for another six months before we release it uh, into the year. So you guys, that was my next question. So the very end of this year, yeah, early yeah. next year, something okay. like holiday season, maybe uh, beginning of next year, something like that. So. Perfect. All right. Cheers.